Tiger Moth planes were a big spectacle, but all eyes were on the three steam locomotives. Usually this great train race was made by 3801 and 3830. This year 3526, 3265 and 3642 are racing for the first time. The winner for this year's Great Train Race competition was 3265. Many railway buildings were specially painted. Here we see one at Maitland with a side view of 3801. The steam fest wasn't entirely steam. Here 4520 on the back of 3526's train is seen here coming into Maitland station after hauling a shuttle trip to Brankston. Thirty-five twenty-six is the sole survivor of the 35 class locomotives. It was built in March 1917 at the New South Wales Railways Everling Railway Workshops. In the early 1930s, 3526 was one of the three locomotives to be specially painted in Caves Express colours. The Nanny was withdrawn from railway service in 1967 and it was placed under the New South Wales Rail Transport Museum's banner. The 35 class locomotive was then used on Rail Transport Museum tour trips until 1975. And so 35 years later many onlookers here at Maitland 
have admired the 35 class locomotive. Meanwhile, while we await the locomotive's departure, DP006 is seen leading two other diesels on a steel track. Meanwhile, City Rail Endeavour Car Set 2804 is seen leaving Maitland on a normal City Rail service. Meanwhile, CPH Rail Motor Number 1 and 7 are both seen coming into Maitland Station after an excursion to Newcastle. A bit of young and old are both seen here. And so in 2004, 3526 returns to service with a little help from Railcorp and the New South Wales Rail Transport Museum. The loco is now ready for a trip to Brankston. While the locomotive departed Maitland, we see a triple-headed 90-class diesel train by Pacific National coming through Maitland with a fully loaded coal train. <laughs> 